It's always refreshing to return to my home planet. Plus, I get a chance to pick up my power powder. I'm mixing business with pleasure with equal success. Hey, Suzette, bring me my Zaz. Here you go. Ah, that's the stuff. So how's business going, baby? With this latest shipment of Zaz, we'll be able to flood the market with a cheaper, higher potency product than the rest of our competition. The Healer Monster Cartel will regain its true position on top. Judges, cops, politicians will all be on the payroll. I've been thinking about creating Zaz Cola or Zaz Burger. Get those manimals really hooked. Great idea, Icky. <laughs> It's funny, this silly green substance could be the great downfall of the human race. Nice to see you, Charles. What brings you to my office today? I'm strongly requesting permission to operate a drug raid on Ica Hubris's mansion, sir. Ica Hubris? I must bring down that intergalactic slime ball. How dare he believe he can push his poison on my planet with total impunity? Charlie, I know you have had a personal tragedy with Zaz. <laughs> Junior, are you all right? Junior? J <gasps> no! But we don't have enough hard evidence to warrant a search warrant, let alone a search and seizure. I want a ramrod. We've got you surrounded. Armed to the teeth raid. I'm not going to sign off on it. Despite the obvious origin of his wealth, without physical evidence, the raid would be a PR disaster. The press would accuse us of going after the intergalactic immigrant community. If you read the papers, you would know the police department is already under scrutiny for alien species profiling. So you're telling me you don't want to go after the galaxy's largest Zaz drug lord because it would be politically incorrect? I think you've been smoking too much of that peace pipe, Chief. Oh, oh, listen, Charlie. Don't go making me out to be soft. I want Ikahubris locked up just as much as anybody. But if we move now, he'll walk on a technicality. You should focus on one of the Gila Monster underlings we do have enough evidence on and work your way up the drug ladder. But with the dawn, our hands are tied. Thanks for your time, Chief. I understand that justice is sometimes a slow process. Well, if Ica Hubris is ever going to be stopped, I'm going to have to put down the badge and get Charles Bronson on his ass. Nothing takes me back to the home planet than taking a break in the old zero-gravity room. Ah, uh, absolutely. It completely relaxes me. Oh, Suzette, you must be a queen among rat brains. <laughs> Why, thank you, Icky. Ah, Earl is back from his intelligence gathering mission. Ew, here comes a rat. I'm leaving. <laughs> Surprise, jackass! This is for my son! Home invasion. Great now I can legally kill you. It burns! Ha! I always wanted a chance to use this. Oh, thank you for saving my life. <coughs> Please call a police and an ambulance. Now, why would I do a thing like that? You didn't think I'd put up with that jerk Ica Doofus to have all his money and property seized by the government, did you? You'll be a national hero. The woman who brought down the galaxy's biggest drug lord. Think of the book sales. I don't have the same aspirations as you. You're the one who wants to be the hero. I know the public would villainize me as the opportunist I am. I never was much for begging. I don't deserve to die. I don't want to die. 
Please, show some humanity. You're right, I am half human. But after all that toxic acid, Icky Huber spat in your face, it's probably most humane for you to get the old yellow treatment. Die, you dirty manimal. I never trusted that rat.